Multistream for Microsoft Teams Rooms on Windows is here, and I want to show a little bit about what it does, as well as talk about what's in store for the future. So let's have a look. OK, before we look at the feature, let's level set and talk about the concept of multi-stream. Today, we deliver one stream. Even if it has multiple tiles, it's composited. The concept of a multi-stream is that Logitech sends multiple video streams to Microsoft Teams, enabling a host of functionality on the platform for users. Essentially, we're giving our remote users more choices and more options for how they want to see and experience the meeting. OK, let's take a look again at what it looks like in the meeting, but this time with a few callouts. In the example I'm overlaying here, you can see that there is a group of five people in the room. Now, in this example, the four most recent speakers are split into their own tiles. Then, as the fifth individual speaks, one of the tiles then shifts to that person. So we're getting four streams of the people around the table, and we're also getting an additional fifth stream of the entire room at the bottom of the screen. Now, what you're seeing here is a multi-stream. The tiles and the room are individual separate streams. And a call out that I want to make about Logitech is that we're the only OEM with a video bar that's offering a total of five streams. Now, I also want to show another option for viewing with multi-stream, subtitling. Now, in this example, it's the same meeting, and I want to point out that, again, I've intentionally put five people in this room to show that even with our four plus one streams, we can use subtitling to get all of our in-room participants into their own tile. So unlike that last example I was showing, now we have all five individuals represented, and we've done that by subdividing each of the tiles. So my coworker who's on the far right of the screen is now being represented throughout the meeting. Subtiling is part of our Right Site 2 portfolio and can be enabled in your CollabOS settings to the Sync app. So this is where we talk for a minute about the future. Multi-stream means more flexibility and functionality for users. One of the first examples is that you can now toggle the room view on and off, and there's a lot more coming. In an upcoming release, we will enable the people recognition feature that enables the profile information of users to appear in individual tiles during a meeting. Again, a feature that wouldn't be possible without multi-stream. So just a few examples of the power that multi-stream will bring to native Teams rooms. Again, this is what our partnership with Microsoft is all about. It's about giving more choices to users when it comes to what they want to see and how they want to experience the meeting. Now, before we close, a quick reminder. This is a feature that's available for Microsoft Teams rooms on Windows with a Rally Bar and Rally Bar Mini. And with regards to setup, it's quick and it's simple. Just a few configurations in the Sync app, and then you're all set to go. We have a detailed guide in the Logitech Sync product hub that'll tell you more. So be sure to check out Multistream today and look forward to what's coming next. We'll see you next time.